Hi, I'm Steve Grisetti, co-founder of MoviePicks.com and author of the MoviePicks.com Guide to CyberLink Power Director 12, 13, and 14. And we are looking at some of the new features here in CyberLink Power Director 14. One feature you may not notice unless you dig really deep into the program has been added to the title designer area. And that is an area that's accessible either by selecting an existing title template and then going up here to modify the selected title template at the top of the panel, or we can create a title from scratch by selecting create new title template. In this particular case, just to keep it simple, I'm going to select create a new template, a 2D title. Now, a lot of these features were available in previous versions of the program, so we've got a title up there, and we can apply under text, some character presets for how that title looks. We can apply uh, different fonts and colors, reflections, font shadow, border, you know all of these things, right? Under the Motion tab, we can apply some animation to the title. We can make it move in different ways across the screen. And switching those is as simple as just clicking on a different motion path and it will create a new motion path for your title. But I'm going to select the option to have no path applied to my title because I'm most interested in demonstrating some of the new effects that have been added to the title designer. And these are under the effects tab and they come in the category of starting effects and ending effects and applying them is as simple as selecting them. Now they have in this library 75, over 75 different animations for how your text enters the video frame and then under the ending effects, 75, more than 75 in fact, effects for how your text leaves the video frame. So let's take a look at how those work. I'm just going to select, for instance, Amplify. And there you can see it kind of appears from the center outward. Balloon, your text floats upward. We'll apply the beam in effect. There it is, it's kind of cool. Your text appears to sort of beam in. We'll apply that one and then I'm going to close starting effects and go down to ending effects. And in ending effects, you have uh, the same library of effects only backwards. In other words, these are ways to get your, your text off the screen. So I had a beam in applied to this title or this particular text block. I can select beam out. Now my text comes in, stays on screen for a moment and then beams out. And by the way, way down at the bottom here, you also have options for applying motion blurs. So if you choose an animation that uh, moves your text left to right or right to left, up and down, you can apply a motion blur to it and add yet another effect to your effect. Now, once you've applied a starting or ending effect, you're not just stuck with sort of the stock animation. You have a little bit of control over that animation. You see there's a shaded area on the timeline at the beginning of my title and there's a shaded area at the end, that shaded area is the length of this starting effect or the length of the ending effect. If I would like my beam in to happen more quickly, I can shorten this uh, starting segment and now my beam in looks like this, very fast. Same with my beam out. If I want my beam out to happen very slowly, I can stretch it much longer and now my title will beam in quickly and beam out slowly. Beam in, beam out very slowly. These are very high level effects and animations and if you look through this library, some very, very cool effects, including things like glows and glitters, uh, things that rotate your text, bring your, your text in one letter at a time, very high level stuff, but very easy to apply. Now, if you wanna know more about the title or if you wanna know more about the program, be sure to check out all the tips and tutorials we have at moviepicks.com. And if you wanna know everything there is to know about CyberLink Power Director 14, be sure to check out my book available on amazon.com and also at the Movie Picks store, the moviepicks.com guide to CyberLink Power Director 14. I'm Steve Rizzetti. Thanks for joining me. Hope to see you again real soon.